Hey, EM, I'm just popping in our next review, uh, but I gotta freshen up first, so don't touch anything. Sure, sure, whatever you say, princess. Oh, you're ready for the Alien sequel review, eh? This should make things very interesting. Ma ha 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 ha. Uh, Alien 2? On Earth? The fuck is this, EM? EM, I told you not to fuck with the DVD player. Well, you did say you wanted to do the sequel to Alien Next. Yeah, but not the cheap fucking Italian ripoff in name only. Sure, a knockoff in name only. But it was displayed in many drive-ins as Alien 2, much like Zombie 2 for Dawn of the Dead. Yeah, except Alien 2 used a legal loophole on the copyright for the original film of Alien because of a book. Fuck, and Zombie 2? Zombie 2 has absolutely nothing to do with Dawn of the Dead. Yes, it's Zombie over here, Zombie 2 overseas because filmmakers decided to make a buck on the zombie name, which was of course Dawn of the Dead's original title. But unfortunately, Zombie and Zombie 2 have nothing to do with each other or Dawn of the Dead. That is very fucking confusing, Princess. Trust me, EM, it gets a hell of a lot more confusing with all the unofficial sequels to Dawn of the Dead or Zombie 2 if you want to get technical. Hell, it gets worse as we go along. Well, what's Zombie 3 called stateside? Ugh, EM, don't you fucking start. You know for a fact we'll get into the whole zombie Dawn of the Dead hole of unofficial sequels and knockoffs soon fucking enough. Now is not the time. Fair enough. What is the story of this film? Well, a spaceship, supposedly the Nostromo, returns to Earth after a failed mission. But the crew have been replaced by hideous aliens that can penetrate people's bodies and make them explode. A group of spelunkers are attacked by the monsters inside an underground cave, but the survivors are in for a surprise when they finally manage to escape the trap. Well, that plot doesn't sound too bad. It sounds good, sure. But fuck if it's not poorly executed. How it leaves more unanswered questions than not. Are the astronauts in the beginning supposed to be the survivors of the Nostromo? And then suddenly, why do we spend the majority of the film in a fucking cave? Why isn't it called Alien 2 Underground? Or why not Alien 2 Alien Goes Bowling? Maybe it should have been called the Alien 2. Space and city sets can be too damn expensive. God damn right, EM. But yeah, they sure had enough room for some nudity though. Well, it is Italian after all, and tits are damn cheap. Yeah, I wish. What was that again? Never mind. So, what's the verdict? Do you really have to fucking ask? I mean, if it wasn't for a novel from the 1930s called Alien, and its alleged connection to that instead of the 1979 Ridley Scott classic, Cyril Apolito would have had his ass in a sling when 20th Century Fox tried to sue him. Apparently the judge on the case either didn't read the novel or see Fox's movie, or somehow was impressed by by this. Hell, it's more a ripoff of The Descent than it is a non-official sequel to Alien. Maybe it was The Descent that ripped this off. Really, um, Really? Okay, okay, I didn't mean it. Anyway, it's not good. It's a fucking train wreck. 
It's an Asylum Class Mockbuster. But of course with a title that sounds like it's from the official franchise due to a technicality. The only reason you need booze for this is not to celebrate, it's to inebriate yourself so numb that you don't care what you're watching. This is going to need all the booze and a fucking stomach pump afterwards. Wow, that is really bad. It's a spaghetti sauce stained imposter to the fucking throne. Do not waste your fucking time. Did they ever make an actual movie to the 1930s alien novel? What the fuck do you think? Yeah, I guess not. Now can I please just watch Aliens, please? Hey, E.M.? Yes, mine princess of darkness? Thanks for the distraction. I mean it. I really appreciate it. Think nothing of it. You seem like you needed it after Bill's passing. Are you sure you're ready to review Aliens after all? Yeah, we'll do Bill and Aliens justice. I promise. But of course, of course. Oh, and one more thing. Yes, mine leads. You know, E.M., you're not bad for a demonic toy monkey. I prefer the term satanic synthetic simian myself.